Hey guys, Sebastian here. I, uh, this is not a typical video that I make. I, it's not a movie, not a short film, not a vlog in any way. This is a little different, something that I want to do whenever I feel like I need to or want to do it. You know, I have a YouTube channel as a means of expression, whether it's to make a video, a movie, an animated thing, a vlog, whatever. And if I want to just kind of sit in front of the camera and talk about something, I'm going to sit in front of the camera and talk about something. And this is something that I've been wanting to say for some time now because I find it really exciting. And if the person that I'm dedicating this to sees this, I hope that you do because, yeah, I, I yeah. <laughs> now, for those who don't know and just kind of clicked on this video because my handsome face on the thumbnail, uh, Chris Stuckman is a YouTuber and a critic. He's been making YouTube videos since 2011, I believe. And he's been making movie reviews since. He is passionate and in love with the art of filmmaking. And what I love about him is that he's super positive in his outlook of movies. Even in the bad ones or the movies that he doesn't love. He's always giving it the benefit of the doubt. He's always putting in a positive spin in it. He's looking, you never, I mean, unless he absolutely hates the movie, you never leave that review feeling this guy is just a critic, but a lover of movies. And that's what he is. He's a film fan before a film critic. I never found him to be a critic. I found him to be a fellow filmmaker, film fanatic, cinephile, all that. And he's someone that I've loved for many years, someone who I've looked up to, whose opinion mattered to me, whose video I was excited to see whenever a new movie I was looking forward to came out, or if a movie I wasn't really, don't really care to see, kind of wanted to see what he would think to see maybe it's worthwhile. So his opinion means a lot to me, and this guy means a lot to me. He's not just a reviewer, he's a filmmaker. He's been making movies since he was a kid. And that's essentially his goal, to make movies full-time. Now, he's already a filmmaker. I'm a filmmaker. If you're watching this and you make movies, you're a filmmaker too. He's already a filmmaker. But he's, as long, same with me, the goal is to have a career to make feature films. And he's expressed that more in the past couple of years, for sure, that while he loves the fan base that he's made and the people that, you know, the subscribers and all the, the viewers, his ultimate goal is to make feature films. And in July of 2021, it was announced that he was making his first feature film. And when I say first feature film, I mean the first theatrical feature film. He's, like I said, he's obviously have made movies since he was a kid. He's even made some short films that have been in film festivals and in theaters. But this is the first movie that's going to be theatrically available or on Blu-ray. When I first heard that, I, along with anybody else who loves Chris, was excited for him. And I still am. But it was until recently that he announced a Kickstarter for his movie because bunch of details and things got in the way of him making it and he announced a Kickstarter and of course I wanted to help in and I believe the initial goal for the Kickstarter was $300,000 and his ultimate when he was asked what would be uh, the biggest number that he could possibly get for the for the Kickstarter he thought the biggest dream would be 500,000 but I doubt it the movie raised a million dollars, over a million dollars on Kickstarter. Not only did it surpass what he thought, it's the highest grossing horror film on Kickstarter. Chris Stuckman is going to make his horror film Shelby Oaks, and I'm insanely, insanely excited for him. As someone who makes YouTube videos, just expresses himself in this channel, that is insanely inspiring and exciting. The future is on us. I am the future, my friend. Paps, if you're watching this, you are the future. Kobe, if you're watching this, you're the future. Tyler, if you're watching this, you're the future. Chris Stuckman is the future. If you're a filmmaker, I don't even know you. You're the future. 
and Chris Stuckman is the one paving the way. So Chris, if you're watching this, I hope you don't feel so much pressure from me hearing that, from you hearing that or from me saying that, but you're inspiring a new wave of artists and creators and storytellers. We will be there the first night or the first day that this movie is ready. I look forward to the behind the scenes that you're gonna make. The, I look forward to the Q and A's. I look forward to the Blu-ray when it's finished, to all the crazy behind the scenes stories that you're gonna tell and that's gonna happen. I just wanna thank you, Chris. Again, if you're watching us, whoever's watching us, first, okay, this is for Chris. Chris, if you're watching us, I wanna say thank you for being who you are, for making what you wanna make, for doing what you wanna do, and for paving the way for the rest of us. This is exciting. It gets me excited to know that someone in this platform is breaking out of it. Not that this, let me make it clear. This is a great platform for us to kind of create expressive voices and to be ourselves without any limit. YouTube is amazing. And I'm so happy I get to actually do this. But the fact that someone is actually breaking out of that and into what he truly wants to do is insanely inspiring. Chris, you're gonna make a hell of a movie. I cannot wait to see it. I cannot wait till it's out for you to make more. And if I meet you someday, which I'm, oh God, sorry about that. If I meet you someday, I hope I can shake your hand and tell you thank you because for many years you have inspired me. And I think this is amazing. And I cannot wait for how this is gonna end up and where you're gonna go from here. To any filmmaker watching this, make your movie. Actually, just make something. Just make something right now. Turn off the video and go make something and release it on YouTube. Do it again the next day. Do it again the next week. We're doing this because we like to, because it's who we are. Go out and make something. And Chris, thank you so much for this. And I wish you the best of luck. I pray that God is able to bless you during this filmmaking journey and that you have the confidence to direct the hell out of this movie, to hone in your craft. And the more that you make, the more that you know who you are as a filmmaker and as a person and as an artist. I cannot wait to see this. I obviously have a lot more to say, but ultimately it's very exciting to see this happen. And I really wanted to express this. And so to leave on the final note, thank you, Chris. Creators, filmmakers, whoever you are, make something cool. Just make something. Bye, guys.